Okay, guys, now let's take a look at a live example of how you create an item on Facebook Marketplace from scratch. So say you found a good example. Halloween is right around the corner, so I'm just going to show you guys how I would have done this listing myself. And then uh, you guys can kind of see the logic and go from there. But so uh, basically say your research pointed you to this item right here. What you can do here, we can just go top to bottom. So at the top, we can start with photos. So what I recommend you guys is just try to use the Amazon review photos as much as you can. And everything else can be regular photo photos, but avoid using white photos as possible. So I would do this one. And I would make it a square image, so it's 596 by 596 exactly. It just looks consistent, it just doesn't make your listing look scammy. If you have them all one size, you know, not like all over the place kind of photos. So, yeah, and these are nice, you know, they kind of show you what the item is all about, basically. So, that's exactly what we need. Okay, so we have two. We, maybe we can do one more. Yeah, we can do one more here and perfect so 599 by 599 great now we can see if the supplier themselves has a good lifestyle photo and they actually do so yeah it's a good one that's a good one too so now we have this saved and they also have a video so let's see if we can also use a video in this example. Okay, that is actually a very good video that I would suggest you guys to do because I'm recording video myself. I cannot record it, but my screen recorder on a Mac, it allows you to record a specific area of your screen or you can download a special software on your computer where you can basically just um set the borders set the frame press record and then it will record this video and you can essentially upload it right here along with your photos so since we already have a good amount of photos saved we can start and um, uploading them right here so for the title um, we can kind of copy paste pretty much everything because all the seo work is already done by our supplier so we just have to show it in the title because there is a limit on Facebook so I just move things around make them a little bit cleaner so it's eight pieces so we can be straightforward uh, then size I like to put all numbers up front so people are not confused what they are buying and have less complaints that kind of thing so 36 feet handling decorations outdoor hanging okay Falling lights And that's still too much. And decor. We already have decoration, so we're good. Halloween light, there you go. That's something that I would do for a description. Then check the photo order. Yeah, the photo order makes sense actually. So perfect. So for the price, let's see. Um, so I have my Facebook calculator right here. So the price of the supplier is $24.99. So it is actually right below the $25 mark. And normally if you order enough items on Amazon, you get free delivery like I currently do. But in some cases, the free delivery is not available. So you will have to pay an additional $5.99 for this shipping cost basically. So what I have, I use a special calculator for the profit. I have my own here, so it also tells me my Mercari offer up stuff. So, because this is Amazon under, um, under 25, we can put it right here. And I included an example calculator for you guys too, so you can use it whenever you guys want. So that's that's all good for you guys there. So I'm just going to adjust the price. Um, let's do like 28. I try to do at least $5 profit. So uh, that is, yeah, that's the number 43. Uh, to cover for five if you guys want you can I mean Do like a dollar profit, but in my opinion, that's a waste of time uh, I try to do at least five because otherwise it's going to be a little bit hard to have any profit in the end of the day. So Okay, 
So we know price 28, but what I'm going to do first is I'm going to inflate the price and make it seem that the item is on a big sale. I'll show you guys a little bit later. So, um, Screen lights, Christmas lights, all the ornaments, that's a better category. Condition is new. Now you can copy the description that I shared because I find that it is clean, it is organized, and it usually answers most questions of people, of potential customers. So I recommend you guys to use a clean description like this in this kind of format. So item description. So what we're going to do, we can just kind of see if we can copy paste some of this. Okay. Perfect combination of a ghost and a green. Perfect. That is the paragraph I would go with. Eight modes of flash and light. And usage. Application rather. So there you go. Recognition of ghost. Okay, and then I also have my Grammarly extension installed, which by the way is a pretty cool thing because it will help you guys to, to catch any typos and whatnot that the supplier might have made. So um, then features we can do kind of copy paste all of this actually. That works. Create live transmission. Modes of light flashing. So kind of, kind of that idea. You know, unique Halloween. Yep, perfect. And then I do kind of like a descending order, you know, so it's easier to read. So it's like kind of going in a line, maybe cut this a little bit. Halloween ghost hat decoration. Halloween decoration. Boom. Now it's nice and even and it's going leftwards, which is exactly what I would like a buyer to see. So it's just easier for them to read and answers all their questions easier. So we can do length. So we can do here like length as an example. 36 feet. Condition brand new and you know anything else. So um, 48 will be string lights, that kind of stuff. 48 will be package include. Do they have that section? If they don't have that section, you know, you can either get an idea of what they include or you can just not include this section if you're not sure. Just rely on the supplier's images. That is an option too. So yeah, that's kind of the description that I would go with here on the price. Um, so 45, once you launch the listing with 45, what you can do, you can adjust this to uh, our calculator told us 28 so from 45 to 28 and it will make it appear like it is on sale so instead of 45 dollars once you launch the listing and immediately go into editing mode and adjust 45 to 28 then the item will show as it is on a big sale uh, which is you know a good psychological marketing move that you can apply that what i do with my listings and it seems like it's working so far so i Think you guys can go ahead and just try it and see if it works for you too. So for quantity, I usually put three to five um, material. You know that's that's all optional. And then the product tags, I have a tags builder actually. So for transpose tags, I actually can can do it this way, and then it will paste here, or I can just do regular tags right here. So what I usually do. I start copy pasting them right here, Halloween, then Halloween decorations, and I will include the link to this document too. So you guys can also use it at your convenience. So, and you know, and so on and so forth. I'm not going to do all 20, 
because you guys get the idea where I'm going with this. So, and you can just paste them right here using my tag builder. So, you're welcome to that one. Then, location, shipping, and local pickup. I keep it at shipping and local pickup because it tends to display the items in both uh, local pickup op um, auctions and shipping auctions. So, you get more exposure this way. So, I would do our calculator told us to use 15. So I would do 15 and boom. If you guys would like to allow your buyers to make an offer, say uh, you you can do like 26 and then still get like three ish, four ish dollar profit. So you can do, if you're fine with that, so you can do 25. And then basically you can do it that way. And then that's it. You just click publish, your listing will go live. Uh, don't forget to change 45 to 28 and then you will have your item uh, going live with uh, the correct price, the correct shipping rate and then it will also show like this on sale instead of 45 it will be um, checked off and here it will be 28 that will be the difference.